All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, bro. We already know what it is, man. It's your boy Trap Boy coming through, and you know, coming through right now. I got this to talk about this aperture light. You know what I mean? Let's get to it. Hold on, let me make sure this mic is. We're gonna be talking about this aperture light that we can see right here. Okay, we'll be talking about the aperture light. But as you can see, this, this um. Right here saying no firmware. When you turn it on, go keep saying the same thing. And what I realize is, um, as you put out this plug, the plug to it, if it's connected to anything, like, you know what I'm saying, power surge, protectors and stuff like that there, and you turn it off without, if you click the power button on that, it'll interfere with this power box. You know, so the best thing that I would say do is connect it directly to the wall instead of keeping it like that. that keep it direct to the wall. And what I found out is like you keep it on for a couple hours and it turn back on the fire rake or whatever it is to the brain, the computer, whatever is working this. I finally let it turn back on and it start functioning right. So make sure that you try to keep it directly connected. You know what I'm saying? And don't even try to connected to one of these surge protectors because it will interfere with that after a while. So, um, in about three, four more hours, it'll come back on. If I realized last time, it was going about five hours before it came back on and everything was working right. So if yours does that, your Aperture 600D does that right there. You go see it. You know, it'll come back on, you know what I'm saying? So then you worry about you know, it'll be back on the bottom. I'm going to come back with it and we go check it out. You know what I'm saying? But we go get it right, man. Straight up, you know, just um, give me about a couple of hours. We go see what's going on. Yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right. Now, this thing has powered back up. As you can see right there, let's, let's go. Let me get this focus right on there. All right, on power back up. As you can see, Woo. the sun back up in this thing. Now, yeah, it wasn't working. Now, how you get it back working, like I say, put it back into the outlet and just wait but, and leave it on the, the, what it is, no firmware or something like that, whatever it say, on there for about a good hour, hour and a half. Right now, I think about two or three hours. And I just said, let me unplug it real quick. I unplugged it out the outlet, then plugged it back in, bam, it come right back on. I don't know why. When you stick it to those um, surge protectors down there, you know, it have a problem when you do that there. For some reason, it'll start blanking. And when you see it start flickering, that means it's going to start messing up. You know what I'm saying? So keep it away from them surge protectors. For some reason, it got some kind of problem with them. You know what I'm saying? But kick it directly to the wall, you know, as much as you could, or, or a long coat, coat cable. You know what I'm saying? Surge protectors, I think it's, it, it'll mess with it or something. The chip, whatever they got inside of it. Aperture, let us know. Engineer, when you engineer, drop a comment below. If you be having a problem with it, let me know what you've been experiencing. What did you do? You know what I'm saying? Did you have to send it back to get fixed or what? You know what I'm saying? This thing costs $2,000, $2,300, dollars whatever it is with taxes. At the time when I first got it, right now you get one for $1,200, I think. But it got a newer version came out. But it's a good unit. Love it. Aperture 600D, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, this thing is it's a beast, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, that's the only little problem that I've been having. But as you can see, now I got this clean, beautiful. Let me see how I look. Let me see how I look on this thing. I'm a little bright like a motherfucker in it. Woo. I bring this step this thing down a little bit. How you work this thing again? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I got that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Damn. Man, okay, let's see. I ain't focus, yeah. Got this 40, this 40 millimeter Zeiss. What do you call this? Baptiste. Baptiste, yeah. Lens on this thing, yeah. I've got to scratch my hand all the way out. Got to be motherfucking Arnold Scorners, nigga. Type motherfucker with these bitches. Shit, yeah, man. But anyway, you see that beautiful, that beautiful light on me, you know what I'm saying? That's that wet. 55%, you know what I'm saying? Give that beautiful daylight. 56K, you know what I'm saying? Color 
on you. Temperature up on you. 56K temperature. You know, that's it. That's it right there for the camera. But how do I look? Aperture 600D. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, that's that out of focus of that A7R. A7. Fuck this camera called again. A7S. A7S3. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Got that, um, what is it here? Got that, that, what it is, R5 or some shit? R5 right here. As you can see, that's the R5. You know what I'm mean? saying? Got the R5 here. Closed up. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. But anyways, if you got a problem with that, you have a problem with it, you know what I'm saying? Just, like I say, the plug is over there. I plugged it in the wall. You wait a couple hours, unplug it, put it back in. It sure turned back on. You know, as so I wore and sent it off. But one day I was just sitting around. I unplugged it. I was mad at it. And I was like, damn. I would look on research. Couldn't find nothing on it. So people been talking about it. But they were like, I just got it. And, you know, messing up, blase, blase, on the rated forms, whatever. Well, like, okay. So I wrote Aperture. You know what I'm saying? When I wrote them, took about took about a week. Three to four days or a week or something like that. And they gave me a place to Atlanta that I had to send it to. And I'm like, man, he's sending my shit there. And when I just was sitting there and I had it plugged in, got mad and frustrated with it. Next thing I know, as I'm sitting there, they just flat, it just came back on. And it was bright as hell because I didn't even have a soft box on there and shit. And man, let me tell you, man, I was blind. I thought it was the sun coming in and shit, man. But you know what I'm saying? And that shit was just crazy as fuck. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, you already know, man. It's your boy, Trap Boy. I'm not.